I don't have a lot of makeup. <laughs> Sometimes there, there ends up stuff in here that maybe shouldn't be in there. I actually have a funny story. You want me to show it? <laughs> Well, first of all, obviously my phone, I think that's not really surprising. Um, I have uh, obviously everything on that phone. Yeah, definitely my music is on there, but also when I keep in contact with my family and my friends. So yeah, WhatsApp I'm using a lot. Also FaceTime, FaceTiming my friends, my family. Um, so I, I guess these are the most important things. I don't have like something I need to do before every game, like calling certain people, but I definitely want to be in contact with certain people before the game. I mean, after the game, it's always nice to, it's, it's, I would say specific my dad, uh, because he's been playing football himself. Uh, so I always want to hear a reaction from him uh, because he, he watches all the games. I want to know how the, how the game looked from the outside because sometimes the feeling can be different when you're in the game. I felt really bad that we, we didn't, didn't get it right and then I want to talk about it, how he sees it because from the outside it can look a bit different. Ramona Backman makes no mistake. Then my AirPods are really important for me uh, because I love music and to prepare for a game uh, I really need to listen to some specific songs. So. Uh, what's interesting is I switch my music style a bit. Uh, it depends on uh, if it's before a game or after a game. Um, I'm listening to different kind of styles, more house music before the game. Something that pumps me up and makes me excited to play. And after the game, it's more calming down. Recently, I just listened to uh, one of my ex-teammates who's done a podcast. Um, with a friend of her. I think they actually played for Paris before, uh, Anja Mittag and Josephine Henning. So I like to listen to their podcast. My iPad, um, obviously sometimes uh, the travels can be long and the hotel stay can be boring. So iPad to watch some series. I actually just started The Walking Dead. Uh, yeah, my fiance loves it and she has been recommending it for a year. Um, never been a fan of watching zombies and stuff like that, but uh, actually the story behind is really interesting. How people would react if there's actually serious problems going on with no food, no water, and um, yeah, it's just very interesting how people can switch. There's some heroes and there's some others that are really selfish. I prefer uh, Rick, is his name, and Daryl, because they're just really caring about the other people. They're not selfish at all, and they're ready to put themselves in danger just to save others. Yeah, so it's my iPad, uh, so a picture with my fiance. Is it possible to have maybe also one picture or...? Yeah, sure. Do I show it in the camera or...? That's a picture of us together, uh, I think the latest one we've, we've done together at the Swiss Awards, where I just won a prize and um, it was really nice to have her with me. Here, this is my... Um, yeah, travel bag where I have all my uh, personal items in there, shampoo, face cream. I'm not using a lot of makeup, uh, very basic, uh, but I use some makeup when I do like interviews or also before a game. What else do I have? I have uh, my perfume, yeah, brush. I have a lot of basic stuff in here. I actually have a funny story because, uh, so obviously this is Louis Vuitton and I, I've had this bag for a while. And always when I bring it, I call it, I need to bring my Louis. And um, when I got a dog a few years ago, I was uh, looking for a name. And uh, some of my friends were like, yeah, but you always say, I, I need to bring my Louis. What about Louis? And I was like, oh, this, this is perfect, actually. <laughs> I'll have a new Louis. <laughs> and yeah, so I called my, my dog Louis. If he um, is alone for too long, then I bring him. He's turning three soon actually in two weeks. Still a baby, too much energy.